time in the book, Jack feels alone, but he is supported by his family and he's aware of how much that support means. You have Jack's father, Dave, who uh, is just referred to as Grandad Dave all the way through because he adores Nessie and he very often babysits her. You also have Jack's brother, Owen, and his wife, Sarah, who are real pillars of strength. Uh, to Jack and Nessie and they kind of provide a bit of a home environment for them so they'll go there for Sunday lunch and they'll look after Nessie sometimes when Jack's working and Nessie hangs out with her cousins, she's got three cousins um, that she adores and so it's kind of a time when, um, when they spend time together where Jack feels that he kind of gets a bit of respite, he gets a bit of support and he gets a bit of help. Owen is Jack's older brother. Uh, he's now a farmer. He did work in finance in London. We don't actually find out what it is in the book, but something happened to him when he was in London and he just changed his life. He came back, he bought a farm, and him and his wife Sarah, who was a corporate lawyer before, decided that they were going to be farmers and they brought their three kids up there as well. And so they're very kind of capable people. Jack says that he thinks Owen is more like his father. Um, he's very matter of fact and very practical, where Jack, I think, is a bit of a dreamer, as well as as having the practical side that he's inherited from his dad. One key thing that's happened in Jack and Owen's life is that their mom walked out on them. Jack was very, very young. One minute she was there, the next minute she was gone, and his dad never really said what it was, although later on they found she suffered from clinical depression and she was an alcoholic and she literally couldn't cope, so she left the family. And so there's kind of this, I think, the reason that Jack wants to provide a really settled home for Nessie and wants to provide all the love and the fun and all the things that he saw his dad having to, pro to provide by himself, a lot of that comes from that. I think there's a lot of history there that's making Jack want to be the perfect dad and to look after his little girl and to kind of be both parents. Now there is a big situation that happens early on in the book between Jack, his brother Owen, and his sister-in-law Sarah. I'm not going to tell you what it is. All I can tell you is the scene when it happens. When I wrote it, I got so angry that I had to. I couldn't write for two days because I was so angry on Jack's behalf. And I won't tell you why. But I think you'll understand when you read the book. <laughs> 